and run it over into one of these vessels. So these are 60 barrel fermentation vessels, and then we have 60 barrel bright tank. Um, How many of you ever get in? We were home brewers. You were what? Home brewers. So we brewed five gallons at a time on our stove, so we graduated up a little bit. But um, typically, so you'll see over there, there's some of those tanks have signs on them, and what the sign says, that's what's in those tanks. Um, and so inside one of those tanks, it holds 60 barrels of beer. So when our brewers come in, they will do um, a double uh, batch brew of 15 barrel batches in one day. So they'll do 30 barrels, and they come back the next day, and they do 30 more barrels. And we'll fill one of those tanks in a two-day period. Um, and then from there, after the beer's done fermenting, we move it over into those short tanks. And um, in those short tanks, that's where the beer is carbonated. Um, so that's where you get the nice little bubbles. And from the, the bright tanks, then we uh, either can or keg the beer. And so you saw our big canning machine. Um, that will can 90 beers, 90 cans a minute. Um, we started out canning um, about 18 cans a minute. So like on a typical packaging day, we may, may can like eight, 800 cases of beer. And the sweet liquid that comes off, to, off of that then goes into these shorter tanks. Um, we have what we call oil kettles, and we have two of them here. So basically, our brewers come in, and they start one batch, and they get it boiling. They clean out the batch, and they immediately start another batch behind it, and get it going inside the oil kettle. So that's how they're able to do uh, 30 barrels of beer in one day. And then the next day, they typically come back and do it again. What you see over here along this wall are our fermentation vessels. So those are 60 barrel fermentation vessels. And they um, will hold basically four batches of beer that we brew here. So you can see some little signs on the front of those fermentation vessels. Um, cream ale, porter, amber ale, those are the beers that are in those tanks right now. And um,